cycling through stacked objects. Here I have an example in which I have three circles drawn exactly on top of each other. That's known as a bad cat. Over here I have three circles as well stacked exactly on top of each other. My goal is to erase two of them. Alright, i got two different methods I can do this. The first one is called cycling through stacked objects. So I'm going to go over and select the erase command. And now I'm going to come over and shift and hold on the space bar. And I'm going to pick. You'll see there's my red one. I'm going to pick again. There's my yellow one. You can pick. There's my white one. There's my red one. And I'm going to want to get rid of my red one. So at this point, I've selected it. I've let go of my keyboard. I'm going to hit enter. Now, I want to erase some more. I'm going to hold shift key down and the space bar down. And I'm going to pick. And I'm going to pick. And in this case, I got my yellow on. I got my white on. And I'm going to say, ah, oh, phone one. I'm going to hit enter. And now I'm going to do this again. I'm going to go up, select, I'm going to hold the shift key down, I'm going to hit the space bar down, and it's following one. Okay? So it's only one there. So if I went up to erase, and I it only found one, which is my yellow one. So I erased the white and the red one. Let's do it a different way over here. Uh, I like this method a little bit better, but we want to go into our selection cycling tool. But we have to turn it on in our status bar. So we're going to go over to our customization, select cy selection cycling, and then down here in our status bar, right here, we want to make sure it's on. Okay, so I'm going to make sure it's on. Now I'm going to go up and I'm going to say erase, and I'm going to pick, and when I pick, all three objects show up. Now, I want to keep my cyan one, so I'm going to come up here and hit my magenta one and hit enter. And now I'm going to do that again. I'm going to come over here, I'm going to pick, and you can see I got two ones left. I'm going to get rid of my, erase my green one, and I'm going to hit enter. And now I'm just down to just my cyan. I'm going to go and hit erase. I'm going to go Windows Crossing, and you can see only one's found. So, uh, we can either cycle through the stacked objects, or we can use selection cycling. And if we're going to use selection cycling, we must make sure that we turn it on in our status bar. And it must be, once it's in the status bar, we have to come over here and make sure it's on. I prefer the select selection cycling. It's a little bit more visual, which I like, uh, but both, work, both methods work fine.